Hello, welcome to Tabletop CP, and today we're going to be uh, doing the game preview for March 24th, 2023. And this week we're going to be playing a game of bolt action. We're going to be doing something a little bit different. And I put all my armies in a hat, all my terrain in a hat, and I wanted to get something totally random, and I think we have. So I drew from the hat the French and the Soviets, and they're going to be fighting in the desert. So I know that a lot of people who are into the historical aspect of this might not like it. But it's pretty common to see, you know, mismatched armies fighting each other, allies versus allies, armies from different theaters, uh, when you go to tournaments and stuff. So what the heck, uh, let's try something totally different. So this is what we're going to be doing. And we're going to be playing Scenario 11, Surrounded. So whoever's the defender is going to place half their force within 12 inches of the center. The rest are going to be coming in from reserve. And the attacker is going to pick half their force to come in first wave. They will come in first wave. And then all, all the forces after that will be coming in from reserve. And it's also a confused fight. So they can come in on any board edge except for the board edge that the last unit came on. So it's always very chaotic. It's always a usually, <laughs> it's always a fun game, I should say. And uh, I'm hoping this will be the same. So let's go ahead and take a look at the forces. Starting off with the French force. It's 951 points, 10 order dice taken from the generic French infantry selector. And everything in this list is regular. So starting off, we have a first lieutenant and man. First lieutenant's gonna have a pistol. His assistant is gonna have an SMG. We're gonna have three regular infantry sections. So they're full strength, 11 men sections. One of the guys has a pistol. He's gonna be the um, assistant uh, machine gunner. And then we're also gonna have one VB launcher in each squad and then a rifle sergeant. Moving on, we're gonna have a medium motor team with spotter. We also have a sniper team. We're going to get a medium artillery piece, no spotter. And they also get a free medium anti-tank gun. So we're going to have two pieces of artillery for the French. And rounding it out, we have an AMD Panhard 165-175 armored car. So it's armor 7, fully enclosed, light AT gun, coax machine gun. Then we got the Somu S35, and it's a light tank as well. The light, oh, uh, yeah, I'm sorry, 8 plus light tank, turret mounted light anti tank gun with a coax machine gun. And it does have the uh, one man turret, so you got to take an order test if you want to advance, even if you're not pinned. Uh, but it is uh, improved front armor, so it's technically a 9 armor on the front. So that is the French force. The Soviet force is 940 points, 10 order dice, and it's a generic Soviet reinforced platoon. So I tried to keep this pretty tame. I didn't want to bring a bunch of late war toys, body armor, badass tanks, and, and Panzerfaust, stuff like that. So I uh, kept everything pretty basic. And everything in this list is regular as well, except for the free inexperienced squads. So starting off, we got a senior lieutenant uh, with man. They both have SMGs. They're going to have two LMG squads. These are not full strength. They're 10 men with two, S two LMG teams per squad and an SMG sergeant. Uh, we're also going to have a uh, SMG squad with eight SMGs. A free, I'm sorry, not free, a four, paid for forward artillery observer. A free rifle squad. Um, and then we're going to have a heavy mortar with spotter. A ZIS-3 divisional gun. And for vehicles, we're going to have a BA-10 and then a Katusha. So no tank except for the BA-10, which is fully enclosed, so it's decent and it will be compared to the French stuff so should be able to hold its own and then the Katusha of course multiple launcher super awesome so um, that's it for the forces and we will be doing tabletop CP after dark tomorrow night or if you're watching this on the day of on March 24th at 17 or I'm sorry 1930 Pacific time uh, so check that out and uh, come by say hi I hope to see you there thanks